Okay, here's a video on how to fix your Skullcandy wireless. Um, no, they're called Skullcandy Crusher wireless. Sorry. Um, Skullcandy by design is um, both good and bad, I guess. They have, especially for this model, uh, the crushers. I like the audio, especially with a heavy bass and all that, where you can adjust your bass and such. They have a weak point though, and that is probably why you're here. Uh, and that is the hinges that you have on these headphones is so that you can fold them. And these hinges are probably the weak points of all these type of um, headphones. They are nine out of 10 times made out of uh, uh, plastic and this is the weak point it will will eventually break and uh, yeah they have a metallic sorry they have a metallic slide uh, or a I don't know what, what do you want to call it a shim or something uh, where you can slide your headphone up and down but the actual hinges is made out of plastic inside of here and it will eventually uh, break down and uh, it's not gonna be an easy fix to to get inside here and, and fix these plastic details so what I did when my broke um, I basically cut out two pieces of uh, plastic with a normal scissor and then I, it's like a broken leg, right? So what you do is you take two pieces of plastic, if I can get the camera to focus, and I have taped this now, so it's not gonna be uh, visible, of course. Uh, you wanna have some pieces of plastic that is uh, firm, but not too firm. You wanna be able to bend it to follow the shape of your headphones it's basically like a broken leg right so you want to have one piece of the plastic on the outside following the shape here and one of them on the inside and then you want to make a you don't want to cut all the way through for the cable you just want to make a insert incision or you know like a little bit of cut out here so that you can fit the cable without cutting um, these two pieces in half or cut the piece in half I should say then just hold them together you wire it or you tape it together with uh, vulcanizing tape or any tape of your choice basically I just find vulcanizing tape very useful because it lasts longer and it is vulcanizing of course it will become one piece of rubber basically holding it all together and uh, yeah this is very sturdy because you wanna make sure it's you know because this is where the force goes goes that way out outwards that way this piece here is gonna be holding together you can't fold it again though but uh, that's a minor problem I guess or you can go on eBay and find these uh, hinges for the crusher wireless there are plenty of people um, printing them with the 3d printers and but they cost about anything from 15 to 20 to 30 dollars or even euros in that sense plus shipping of course and that many times is like half the price of what you can get for these headphones on a uh, on a sale basically these are in re in general 200 dollar uh, headphones so yeah I hope that helps you and uh, yeah, two pieces of plastic, one scissor and some vulcanizing tape is all you need basically to fix your broken uh, skull candy crusher wireless headphones. Good luck out there, stay safe.